My name is Travis Scott, and in this day and age, one of the biggest questions is the prevalence of smartphones. I personally believe they are a good thing and have vastly improved our lives. In fact, I'm using the timer on my phone right now to, record, to time this presentation right now. The, my first slides will further prove my point. Cell phones were on the market in the 1980s, but they weren't very prominent. Only people involved in the business really had any use of them. They were also really expensive, so most people didn't see the point of trying to get one. Especially since landlines were still used heavily in that period. However, things changed significantly around the 2000s when cell phones found themselves becoming much more cheaper and available. Many people used them once they figured out how, how convenient they were and how, how they made going out safer since you now had a constant way to communicate with people. But they still weren't a necessity yet. On the other side of things, pull over music was starting to become a thing. With MP3s and iPods began gaining prominence as people were looking for better ways to carry music with them outside of their stereos. They were fine, but not exactly what people needed that would completely eclipse CDs. In addition, there was also portable gaming systems like Game Boys and PSPs that attract children to portable devices. These were always around, but there needed to be a more convenient way to handle them. There were various unsuccessful attempts to bridge the gaps in the technology, such as the gameplay video which imported episodes and movies onto a Game Boy Advance. There were also attempts to put movies and episodes onto the iPod, but they were of poor quality. Eventually, people decided they needed things better in a more convenient package. This package would be known as the smartphone. It incorporated all these in a perfect condition. You could play videos on it, record with it, play games on it, and much more. I believe it has personally revolutionized the way we live and all for the better, and it will only continue to do so in the future. One of the many ways this changed our lives is through the convenience of the GPS that's in, inbuilt into the phones. Previous GPS models in years past were very cumbersome and very inaccurate. Smartphones, however, are constantly aware of your position and give you up to the minute instructions that, to get to your destination quicker and safer. Translators have made traveling and, and communicating much, much easier than they were in the past. If you ever went anywhere further away, you can simply speak into your phone and it'll translate it for you. It'll get rid of, this is heavily broken down the language barriers that you caused so many problems before. And I personally use it myself and I can tell you it works perfectly fine. Another huge advantage is a, is a personal finance you can now manage entirely through your phone. You no longer need to always carry around money and you have always, and you're always aware of your bank account information. You can have information on your credit cards at all times, so which makes purchases much easier. What might be the most significant of these changes brought to our lives by the smartphone is it's the cameras that are built into everyone's phone. Now everyone always has a camera on hand. This is great because now you can personally record memories easily and it's actually helped the law by recording crimes in progress. This is good because of the way information is distributed. This allows people to truly understand everything going on around them. Before people were dependent on TV and newspaper to get current information. Now it's always available up to the minute updates. You're never left behind and you always know what's going on. Staying connected there is easier than ever now. Even if you live far away from someone, you can still easily communicate with them with it. Camera on your phone so you can see them visually as well to FaceTime. People are no longer people are no longer limited by distance and are always finding new ways to communicate with each other, such as Twitter and Facebook. Social media websites like Facebook and Twitter are now very essential to everyday life. It is how every nearly everyone entirely focuses on their social life now. Nowadays everyone uses them in both casual and professional sense, use to connect with people. And you use it to find jobs now is a common way of using it. Businesses use social media to promote themselves. And some people have used them to actually launch their ideas off the ground. And to tell people when they have jobs available for them. Such as uh, food delivery service can be, can be launched with social media. 
This is greatly benefited us in the long run. Some people have said that our dependence on smartphone phones has actually divided us, but I feel like it's actually gotten us closer than ever before. We can now communicate with people much more easily through Facebook or through FaceTime videos. You never really feel like someone's too far away to communicate with them. Storing things is much easier now than it was in the past. In the past, we used DVDs and CDs, but now we can get rid of the huge shells of that we kept, that we had in our home. Now we have all these things available at our fingertips. This is a huge advance because in the digital age has greatly diminished the amount of wasted space in our homes. Finding information in this day and age is much easier as you simply have to enter something on your phone and it's right there for you. This has helped me on various products both in that at, at the house and away from the house. And it's something I really wish I had on me when I was younger. I'm sure everyone feels the same. Smartphones are only continuing to develop further and further each day. There are, there are many companies and people who are coming up with new ideas to make them better. And they are becoming more and more available to people, which is important because they are becoming more and more of a necessity. Especially with all the new ideas coming out for them. Smartphones have changed things for the better is my definite opinion. I couldn't imagine my life without it, and I'm sure there are, there are others who feel the same. Things are more convenient now than they've ever been, and people are able to connect with people through their phones. I plan to keep finding new ways to improve my life and us. I may even feel, find a way that helps everyone change the way we live.